well today, this morning, I had put in a tweet on Twitter if anybody wanted to get healed with the power of Jesus Christ. Um, someone hit me up and let me know what's wrong with them. Um, Troy and I had called them to give us the information. We prayed for them and in Jesus' name. They felt the fire of the Holy Ghost heal them. And I just want you to check out the video. It's so dope. Like, God is real and this video just proves it. Yeah. Hello. How are you doing, sir? How's it going? You said your name is Bo? Yes, sir. Okay, Bo. Um, we're just going to pray with you and... God's gonna, he's gonna touch you. He's gonna touch you right where you are. Now, what's, what's, what's going on? Like, what's, what's the situation? What's going on with you now? I have a, well, I actually have a couple of different diseases. I have a disease called Marfan syndrome and a, another one called Mad Love. I'm losing all the feeling in my legs and I just can't sit up. I'm always busy. And oh. I have a dilated aorta, which causes a lot of pain in my, in my, uh, chest and abdomen. Okay. Now was this like a condition, like like a, um, like you were hit by something, or was like just a sickness, or like what is it? How did it no, like? It's a genetic, genetic uh, condition. Okay, so this is what we're gonna do. Um, right now, are you? What are you sitting down, laying down, standing up? Like what are you? What are you doing? I'm laying down right now. Laying down right now. Okay, and you said yes, you sir. you feel the pain like right now is like from zero to ten, like the pain. Like ten is unbearable, five is okay, zero is like where, where would you say you fall in that zero to ten range? Um, well, five or six. Five or six, okay. Now, uh, we'll we'll do one thing at a time. You said, where where do you feel the pain the strongest right now? My abdomen. Abdomen, okay. What I want you to do is take your left hand and 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 place it over your abdomen right now. Okay. Okay. Right now, in the name of Jesus, I command healing to flow to his abdomen. In Jesus' name, I command that spirit of infirmity to go right now. I command healing. I command healing over Bo's entire spirit, over his soul, over his body. In Jesus' name, healing flow now. Amen. Amen. So now, Bo, now how, do you, how, how does it feel right now? Tell me what's going on with you. It feels warm in the area. Okay, so um, it was like at a five or six. Where, where, do, you, where do you where do you feel it is now? Like what? Well, the discomfort kind of went away a little bit down to a two. A two? Okay. Okay. Now take your right hand. Take your right hand and and place it there. Okay. We're gonna go again. In the name of Jesus, I command his abdomen right now. I speak to that spirit of infirmity and I tell it to go. In the name of Jesus, you must go. We release the power of God over Bo and you must go and you must leave him right now. In Jesus' name, in Jesus' name, in Jesus' name, go. All right, Bo, now, now, now check it out. How does, how does it feel down there? Amen. amen 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 so what's what's going on right now is that the power of god is is keep your hand there keep your hand on your abdomen the, the power of god is flowing through the the telephone wire the telephone line and it, it, it's it's working all through you right now so it's, it's going to take it's going to take a little bit of time to work through your whole body but but god's he's working he's working through you right now um name something else that that's that's going on that we can target right away definitely do that and you know in the spirit there's no time or distance you know we're we're in we're all the way in california you know you're in, you're in colorado but there's no there's no time or no distance so what i want you to know um because it was a spirit of infirmity that was attacking you 
and we we have destroyed that that's gone away but what i need you to know in your spirit is that god loves you god loves you and he's placed a gift inside you and the enemy has come to try to take that gift from you because you're a strong man you're a strong man of god and don't let him try to tell you that you're weak that you're not strong but you have a direct calling in your life and that's why the enemy comes to try to take people and distract them from their calling but i'm I'm here to tell you today that you are where you need to be. The spirit of the living God is upon you and you're a million times stronger, more powerful than any demonic spirit. So right now, I just want to encourage you right now and, and build you up in who Christ is in you because it's not so much about something you have to do or something you have to say, but just acknowledging the fact that Christ, the hope of glory is on the inside of you right now. So the same spirit that me and Ashley prayed over you, the same spirit that rose Christ from the dead, the same spirit that was in the Apostle Paul resides on the inside of you right now. So I just want to encourage you to acknowledge that that spirit is in you. And the minute you acknowledge what's actually in you, the minute that all that shackles and bondage, will, it will break off you instantly. So I just want to encourage you right now to know that that spirit, that Holy Spirit, the power of God resides on the inside of you today. Not tomorrow, not next week, but today. So the minute you realize how powerful you are and what Jesus has placed on the inside of you, all of that will just will just fall fall off of you. Amen. 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 So you're feeling better. Yeah. Amen. So this is what I want you to do. Um, actually, I'm hearing the Holy Spirit tell me to to have you read Philippians. Uh. Just read the whole book. <laughs> read the whole book okay. of Philippians, and um, and and specifically, as you're as you're gaining a greater understanding and a greater not just understanding, but as as these truths become a reality to you, the things that you think you're struggling with will no you'll no longer struggle with them because Christ has defeated the enemy, and greater is He that's inside of you than He that's in the world. All right, so do that. Keep confessing his word, and then um, keep in contact with Ashley. Let, let her know how you're doing, I guess, through Twitter or however it is that y'all communicate, and then your testimony will be a blessing to many. Okay. All right? All right, thank you so much for your time. I appreciate it. All right, God bless you. God bless you. you. Bye. God bless you, too. Thank you. All right. <laughs>